So what was it that um, attracted you to Swallows and Amazons? I think it's... It, it, I've always wanted to make a, a, a film about childhood, actually, and I did make a documentary series a long time ago with Peter Simons, who's also in the audience about childhood, and it's always been a subject I've wanted to revisit. And so when I was asked to come on board, as it were, with Swallows and Amazons, I realised that what, what it was really about, deep down, was about the essence of childhood and what it means to be a child and have that wonderful unfettered imagination which can dance on a sixpence between ima the imaginary world and the real world is what children love doing and I, I think that's what I really loved about it. So the story is one thing but the feeling of, a, of, of childhood is what mm. I, I really liked mm. about it and that sense of freedom that we have all seem to have lost in our iPads. <laughs> I was going to ask you about Pokemon Go, but um, well, maybe, uh, well, maybe, maybe that's the next project.